here in this code sample we have the definition for the function numbers and when we invoke numbers we get in return an object we can treat as a sequence so we can do the for loop in order to iterate the numbers but actually what numbers returns is an object an object we can iterate using for but only when we iterate only then underneath there is a, an iteration over the numbers in this sequence this sequence of uh, numbers that includes the numbers 0 to 9 well uh, unless we add this line we couldn't see what I have just explained in action but since we do have this specific line then we can see that this output is delivered to the screen concurrently with the execution of this loop which means that when this loop takes place concurrently with that we have this loop underneath taking place.